Hey friends, it's Jess from Pop Art Puppy Dogs. I'm here today to show you how I paint the dots on my Pop Art Puppy portraits. These dots are called Ben Day Dots because they're named after the printer and illustrator Benjamin Henry Day Jr. Now these dots are a printing technique dating back to 1879 and used in comic books of the 1950s and 60s to create secondary colours using the four colour printing process of cyan, magenta, yellow and black. The small coloured dots are closely spaced, widely spaced or overlapping to create a different colour effect. These dots were used by the famous pop artist Roy Lichtenstein in a lot of his artwork. I love the effect they give a painting, so let me show you my technique and how I achieve these dots on my painting with these two super cute miniature poodles, Pepe and Chico. Okay, so the secret to my pop art dots is this stencil. I bought this online at Stencil Warehouse and all you need to do is place it over the canvas and line it up to the edges so it's straight. And then using masking tape, lightly tape it down to the canvas edges. Did you know that the word poodle is derived from the German word poodle, which means splashes in water or puddle, because the breed originated as water retrievers. And their coat is also water resistant, which is pretty cool. All right, so now that that's secure, just take a light pencil and all you need to do is trace over each individual dot onto the canvas. Now that we've finished drawing the dots, just gently remove the stencil from your canvas. And if you had any gaps around the edges of the canvas that you missed with the stencil, just use it to line up against the dots you've already drawn to fill in the gaps on the edges. All right, so now we're ready to paint. Just take a small, short, rounded brush and have lots of paint ready in the colour that you want to paint the dots. Now, all you need to do is dip the paintbrush in your paint to load up the tip of the brush with lots and lots of paint. On your canvas, paint each individual dot using half circle motions, trying to keep the dot as round as you possibly can. It's best to keep going back for more paint, just so you've got a lot to work with on each dot and it keeps them all consistent. Did you know poodles are one of the most popular pets in the world? They're friendly and they're loyal and they're also one of the smartest dog breeds in the world. Then because of that, they're very easy to train. There's three sizes of poodle. There's the standard poodle, the miniature poodle and the toy poodle. And they're also often mixed with other dog breeds to create many gorgeous puppy combinations. And they have really gorgeous names too, like Labradoodle, Moodle, Cavoodle and Schnoodle. There's so many oodles, it's no wonder they're so popular. I'm going to finish this canvas off now, so we'll see you guys when it's done. Well, there you have it, my technique of painting pop art dots or bende style dots. Now, if you'd like to get your paws on a custom pet portrait, just like the one of Pepe and Chico here, please feel welcome to email me. It's jess at popartpuppydogs.com or you can look me up on my website, Facebook or Instagram using at Pop Art Puppy Dogs. I'd also love for you to join my mailing list for updates on my world of pets and art. There's also a couple of freebie downloads in it for you too. From me, Pepe and Chico, thanks for tuning in and we'll catch you later friends.